<laughs> it's not um, the money you want. What do you want? I don't like that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but what if they give you a million dollars and they're like, okay, now you must keep it forever. Yeah, that's not going to work. No. Yeah. What you want is what you can do with the do money. With it. It's True. not the money. True. And that's where people trip up. They're like, oh, I want the money. I'm like, no. What do you want? Exactly. Well, I want a pay raise. Okay. Why do you want a pay raise? Because I deserve to be in a better, a little bit there, a better position at work or be respected and, you know, have days off or, yeah. Yeah. So, so I'm going to move to a fork now. <laughs> Yeah. So now if I want money, because I do have, like everyone, I have bills to pay. I tell the, uh, my guides, okay, here's how much money I want. Dang. And here's when I want it by. I want this money so I can have all my bills paid without any concern. So I don't get stressed or nervous or anxious, so I'm sleeping well at night. So that way I can be the open vessel for the work you want me to do. Mm -hmm. So really this is for you guys. It's not for me. Right. Wow. I'm having fun with the forks. They're letting me do this. Yeah. So I'll tell them that. And then that day, however much money I need, a little more than that worth of work will come to me. Great. Yeah. Yeah. And all the work will be completed, you know, before the date. So, but um, I think I told you about my friend who could just manifest money in his checking account. Yeah, that's amazing. Okay. So you, you know, guys tried that. It hasn't worked yet. Well, here's the thing. Okay. I think I so, didn't do a component of that. Yeah. Yeah. I can't give away his name. I promised to him. No, no, no. Don't, him. don't. Yeah, I promised him I never would. Um, but I have this friend who, whenever he needs <laughs> money, he this just feeling like it's running away. <laughs> <laughs> so whenever he needs money, he does a meditation where he visualizes himself going to his ATM and like he visualizes every detail. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Then he deposits that much money in his checking account. And um, I sat with him one time. He said, look, I'm about to manifest $1,000. So we went online. He showed me his checking accounts, you know, like not the username or password or stuff, but like he showed me his bank statement and I saw how much money was in there, how much was pending, et cetera, et cetera. But and then we sat and we manifested together. He's like, you go ahead and help me. Um, and he said, and while, while I'm doing it, you go ahead and do it with me. Um, and dream that, you know, just meditate that you are with me while I'm doing this. I'm like, okay. So he did it. He deposited $1,000. Wow. He went online, looked at his statement, and literally there was $1,000 just deposited. And so he had deposited cash so uh, the bank the, <laughs> the bank didn't have an issue with this like well, no because um i had the idea in my head i kept saying where did it come from how did you get this and he's like he said the mistake is thinking if you receive something that means it came from somewhere but really the bank account is just computer code a series of numbers and all he did was adjust the series of numbers. So very nice. So this money did not come from anywhere. It was just adjusting code in the program to alter a series of numbers that, you know, do not have any impact on anyone. So then we tried with me and, uh, with his help, I was able to deposit money into my account. And then I freaked out. And the next day I went to the bank and I said, 
there's a thousand dollars in my account. And they said, okay. And I was like, where did it come from? And they're like, you deposited it. And I was like, but where did it come from? Like, are you sure it should be there? And they're like, yeah, it's your money. And I said to them, I think it's a mistake. I think it's just code. And they're like, uh, no, like they look and they're like, no, this is your money. I don't know what you want us to do. No one's ever asked us to like take from them before. <laughs> so since then, a couple of times on my own, because I got overwhelmed asking for a thousand dollars, although at that point it was so helpful. Um, on my own, I've been able to deposit up to a hundred dollars at a time. But my brain locks up and it's like, no, 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 no. You can't do more than that. Like that's as much as I can do before I freak myself out. So um, for me, what works is I just have my guides bring me the amount of work that I need for the amount. So I have trouble getting out of that. For me to receive, someone else has to give attitude. So that's something I've been working on the last, this was like, I guess like six or seven years ago, and I'm still working on it. <laughs> but um, yeah, a good lesson that uh, this, the whole point of this manifestation is not for me to get money, for me to work on why is it in myself I block things just happening for me, as opposed to feeling like I have to work for them. Yeah, I'm, I've worked on manifestation too. I mean, and I have realized that it does come in different forms, but the one constant is to be very clear about the end result. Like yeah. exactly what it is. Like you said, if you say, oh, I want to have, I don't know, like a million dollars or whatever, well, Having done what? What to do with it? What?